Yeah. Hi, students. I am Dr. Badrinath. Uh, today's topic is uh, advantages and applications of the polymers. I am in love with polymers. I am in deep love. Whenever I was in PFAPC, I was in love with the uh, because polymers is uh, very, very important, especially advantages and applications. Especially, number of times it was appeared in the question paper of regular examinations. So, uh, in competitive examination, this is not important. You can be no doubt that point, need not to be worry about that. But however, regular examination, this is very important. Furthermore, if you want to develop rapidly in the FRD, formulation, research and development wing, if you want to develop, if you want to go to the higher stage, then polymers are very, very important. Okay, so advantages and applications without any delay, we will see here. Uh, I have shown the chitosan. Chitosan, see here, some you can be call it as a ketosan also. Chitosan is a polymer which is extracted from the fish. You cannot prepare chitosan directly in the laboratory, it is a very hectic work. You cannot prepare also. So, from the fish, you can extract this polymer chitosan. See, without polymers, you cannot expect the pharmaceutical industry. Without polymers, you cannot expect the tablets, capsules, uh, injections, parenterals, compulsory, you need polymers. Even the containers, even the packaging, also emulsion bottle, suspension bottle, okay, syringe, the syringe, what you are using for the injection, everything, each and every step, you need the polymer, polymer, polymer. So if you go to pharmaceutical industry and you see that around the industry, compulsory without polymer, you cannot construct the polymer pharmaceutical company also. Like that. See here, very interesting one, chitosan is a polymer we will see in this video. Uh, this chitosan is having a mucoadhesive properties, very useful to prepare the buccal tablets. Buccal tablets are mucoadhesive tablets, mucoadhesive microparticles, whatever it may be, mucoadhesive in nature. This is mucus, you know, wet surface in our body is nothing but a mucus. So, mucoadhesive property, this is here you can see, this is a buccal tablet. See, this tablet, you cannot swallow this tablet. You cannot swallow. This is not meant for to swallow with a glass of water. This tablet is meant to stick here. Mucous membrane of the buccal cavity. That's why this is called as a buccal tablet. Mucoadhesive tablet like that, you can call it as. This mucoadhesive nature of a tablet, you can be get it from the chitosan. So, your drug, paracetamol or ibuprofen, whatever it may be, your drug along with the chitosan, you can be mix it. Mix both, you can be mix it and you compress it into a tablet. The tablet is having a mucoadhesive property. See here, that property is due to the, not from the drug, that property is due to the presence of the chitosan. Ketosan. Okay, right. That's why, yeah. Uh, we are studying in our drug delivery system. This is your syllabus here. You can see the advantages and applications almost both are same. Okay, don't differentiate it, almost same, not exactly, but however, in the examination under the same heading, you can be right either advantages or applications, commonly you can be right. Don't worry about that, I have the guarantee for that. Okay, this is my mobile app, I have already told you. Uh, uh, this is, you can be download from the Google Play Store, my notes is available, videos are available in the YouTube and notes is available here. And after downloading from the Google Play Store, open the app and go to the store option here. You can see here store option. There you can be find all my MPharmC, BPharmC, PharmaD, all courses, whatever I am offering that you can be find it. You can be click on that. You will get my complete notes in the PDF format. And this is my YouTube channel. In my YouTube channel, you go to the playlists here. You can see here playlists. Here, subject-wise, you can be fine. If you compress, if you press on the each subject, if you click on that, if you tap on that, you will get a topic-wise again. See here, pharmacology one. Here, if you touch it, pharmacology one videos will come. So you can enjoy. If you want to the notes, go to the app. If you want to the this one, and see polymer ability. Different polymers. There is thousands of polymers. Thousands, thousands of polymers are there. Yes. See, each polymer, each group of a polymer having its different abilities. 
different polymers is having a different abilities so what as a pharmacist you have to be very intelligent you have to find what is its ability and where we have to use it you you as a pharmacist you should be very smart you should be very smart okay see here addition ability addition addition means sticky in nature gum just like a gum adhere sticky okay some polymers like a hpc hydroxy propyl cellulose this polymer is having a addition ability so we are using as a binders during the granulation here you can see hey, this is a powder this is a powder powder di directly you cannot compress into a tablet you have to add some binders some sticky nature so one paracetamol particle another paracetamol particle particle powder particle will be stick together with the help of binders with the help of binder so binder is compulsory binder plus paracetamol powder you can mix it both you compress into a tablet easily you can compress easily so it can be powder you have to convert into granule with the help of binder once you prepared the granule it was very easy to compress into a tablet okay like that and hardness and toughness some polymers are very hard very tough very tough so polyvinyl chloride like this pipes pvc pipes we are calling for general purpose for plumber we are using for the drainage or water supply whatever it may be very hard and very tough these pal this pvc polyvinyl chloride plastic plastic pipes we are calling regularly using for the containers see here suspension bottle emulsion bottle all these are using for the by pvc polyvinyl chloride next thickness building ability some polymers increases the viscosity increases the thickness boost to the thickness enhances the thickness that is viscosity if you want to very viscous suspension very viscous emulsion very uh, high viscous emulsion okay or high viscous suspension then you have to use a tragacantha like rajnikanth tragacanth acacia acacia gum these are the just like a gums increases the viscosity name itself indicates gum and film formation ability these polymers forms a film smooth film like here you can see uh, polymer uh, um, spray polymer spray we are spraying on that so the tablet surface uh, will be become wet and it forms a film like this here see it forms a smooth film around the tablet like a cap just like cap you can give it in your mind cellulose acetate pellet coating of tablets coating of pellets because form it forms a film okay like that see uh, solubility in organic solvent see poly methacrylates having a shows the difference in the solubility of organic solvent it dissolves in some organic solvents whereas it doesn't dissolve in another organic solvent this type of property we are using for the controlled release using for the modified release next gelling ability it becomes a gel gel okay liquid will become a gel like hpmc hydroxy propyl methyl cellulose hpmc very popular very important okay controlled release we are using controlled release tablets and ph dependent solubility oh very very interesting uh, eutragets i am i am in love with eutragets all my projects are uh, eutragets only ph dependent solubility if you change the ph its solubility will be increased if you change the ph its solubility stops eutragets will not soluble okay for like that we can use uh, in the control release i will show you in the coming slides next methyl cellulose controlled release coatings coatings viscosity boosters for orals orals you are taking like orals and semi solid topicals like a viscosity enhancement methyl cellulose if you want to increase the stickiness or viscosity then you can add methyl cellulose ethyl cellulose for sustain release taste masking see some of the medicine see my medicine is bitter if medicine is bitter you add ethyl cellulose see medicine plus masker this is called as a masker it masks the taste because some medicines children cannot take so it increases the taste masking uh, and stability enhancement it increases the stability of the formulation 
నెక్స్ట్ సేమ్ హెచ్పిసి హైడ్రాక్సీ ప్రొఫైల్ సెల్యులోస్ హైడ్రాక్సీ ఇథైల్ సెల్యులోస్ హైడ్రాక్సీ ప్రొఫైల్ మిథైల్ సెల్యులోస్ ఆల్మోస్ట్ ఆల్ ఆర్ సేమ్ ప్రొఫైల్ మిథైల్ ఇథైల్ గ్రూప్స్ ఓన్లీ చేంజింగ్ యూజింగ్ యాజ్ ఎ బైండర్స్ ఫిలిం కోటింగ్ ఆల్మోస్ట్ సేమ్ బైండర్స్ ఫిలిం కోటింగ్ కంట్రోల్డ్ రిలీజ్ సిఎస్ఇఆర్ హౌ ద కోటింగ్ ట్యాబ్లెట్స్ ఆర్ కోటింగ్ సి ట్యాబ్లెట్స్ ఆర్ కోటింగ్ కలర్ఫుల్ ట్యాబ్లెట్ యూ విల్ గెట్ ఓకే హెచ్పిసి యు కెన్ ఎంజాయ్ ఎంజాయ్ యు కెన్ ఎంజాయ్ విత్ కలర్స్ ట్యాబ్లెట్ డిఫరెంట్ కలర్స్ ఓకే సి హౌ ఎలిగాన్సి ఇస్ దేర్ హౌ ఎలిగాన్సి ఫిలిం కోటింగ్ విస్కాసిటీ మాడిఫైయర్స్ ఫర్ టాపికల్స్ ఓకే అండ్ సి ఐ షోల్ నో యూట్రాజిట్స్ ఆల్ మై ప్రాజెక్ట్స్ ఆర్ మై స్టూడెంట్స్ ప్రాజెక్ట్స్ ఆర్ యూట్రాజిట్స్ ఓన్లీ పాలి మిథైల్ అక్ట్రైలైట్స్ ఇట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ ఎస్ ఎూట్రాజిట్స్ యూట్రాజిట్ డిఫరెంట్ గ్రేడ్స్ ఆర్ దేర్ pH dependent see here entire our gastrointestinal tract having a different pH so if you want to release the tablet your medication here use the utrazit if you want to deliver your medication here use uh, you use, uh, use utrazit which part you want to deliver that grade you have to be select this tablet don't prepare a plain tablet prepare a tablet along with the utrazit and where wherever you want you can be released like that you can be selected the different grades and cap cellulose acetate phthalate is acid resistance this is cap cellulose acetate phthalate take tablet put a cap put a cap like that you can remember cap cellulose acetate phthalate so that it bypasses the gastric acidity entire acidity section it the tablet will not be resolved directly it releases in the intestine entry coating this is called a acid resistant entry coating tablet this cap will be dissolved in the alkaline ph only okay right next polymer polyvinyl alcohols okay polyvinyl pyrrolidin polyacrylic acid carbo this is also called as a carbomers or carbophals okay see here viscosity boosters in ophthalmic solution see this is very very important ophthalmic solution if you are preparing just like a watery it will be flow away from the eye one drop two drops also it will be flow away like that you you want to increase the viscosity viscosity you have to boost so one drop is enough now one drop is enough the drop will be installed in the eye it will be stick on to the eye because viscosity it cannot flow away it cannot flow away okay right ophthalmic stabilizers in a colloidal dispersion so we are using it polyvinyl pyrrolidin binder in dry granulation wet granulation direct compression method also we can be used pvp very popular pvp mall very popular and uh, paa it forms a gel from a ph 7 and above in situ gel formation inside a gel when ph is greater than 7 then it forms a gel like that and uh, polylactic glycolic acid biodegradable and implants controlled release why this biodegradable what is this biodegradable means see in old days what they are doing is after stitching they will stitch with the thread that thread after 10 days or after 15 days they will cut they will remove the stitches okay once after the com- stitches completed 10 days the doctor will say you come back on 10 days then i will remove the stitches okay but nowadays what happen need not to be remove the stitches stitches will be mixed with the skin those type of polymer they all these polymer with are made up of a polymer slowly biodegradable all medical devices are using absorbable sutures now this is called as absorbable it is absorbed into the body sutures ligatures two important topics okay now it is absorbed see now all medical devices also polymer without polymer there is no world there is no world there is no world that's it silicon see here silicon it looks like this silicon silicon is using for the cataract operation they are using they are preparing the lens here artificial lens see here single focal this mono focal lens this is a tri and that is not our part okay and stunts for the heart stunts these stunts are made up of see here uh, whenever there was a blockage of coronary arteries very smallest arteries in our body uh they they will put the stunts here stunts so that this will not adhere because stunt will uh, um, uh, stops the sticking of these two so, okay pacemakers preparation of the pacemakers valve i intraocular lens iol intraocular lens adhesive in wounds wounds dressing 
number of number of alginates polyalginic acid controlled release formulation of nanoparticles microparticles chitosan oh, chitosan very fish wherever chitosan come fish 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 muco adhesive site specific drug delivery particular site you want to deliver the drug use chitosan coatings uh, aid <coughs> it aids the drug penetration also it enhances the penetration like muco adhesive uh, that also we saw no uh, it enhances it boosts up polyethylene glycols peg p is a peg peg small peg small peg large peg okay applied surfaces implants grafts to minimize the immunogenic response it decreases the it grafts the immunogenic response okay that is another wonderful topic uh, this polyethylene glycols you have to be uh, uh, you can reduce uh, see whenever there is a artificial uh, kidney transplantation everything our body own body it will be reacts it doesn't allow the another uh, another person kidney in our body in such a cases doctors will give immunosuppressants immunosuppressants okay uh, in such a cases polyethylene glycols they can be used so this is my youtube channel and this is my mobile app uh, you can be um, download it and enjoy start reading and enjoy okay all the best